The garden is one of the easiest places for people to macro in, but are the admins actually cracking down on it? That's why I'm going to test to see how many times I can get macro checked in the garden to find out if they're actually doing anything about this problem. Since the garden came out a few months ago, I've been farming quite a bit, making over a billion coins in the process. But during this time, I haven't got macro checked even once. Now I know some people have gotten their account beaned from the garden before, and I've made a community post a bit ago asking how many of my viewers have actually got macro checked in the garden, and surprisingly a low amount of 24% said they had. And I say that's pretty low because you would assume that most people should be getting macro checked with the amount of people grinding out the garden right now. And most of the time when people are farming, they don't really tend to move their head a lot, especially with the people that change their keybinds, which I would assume is a big flag for being a macroer. So let's put their systems to the test. I went to the garden and started farming netherwalk for a total of 3 hours to see how many times I would get checked in that time. To look as much as a macro as possible, I even changed all my keybinds so I didn't have to use my mouse at all, and use my farm with teleport pads. This means I could just hold down two buttons on my keyboard and I would farm forever. Now, do you want to guess how many times I got macro checked in 3 hours? Taking into account that I did get kicked for a scheduled reboot, which seems to happen way more in the garden for some reason. And that I just held down two buttons the entire time, looking as much as a macro as possible. Well you'd be right if you thought zero times, because I didn't get a single check even once. But are we even surprised at this point, with them moving on to the next rift update already, and probably focusing all of their energy on that. Now I've said this before in my videos that they should just add what they do in foraging, but they give you a capture to solve every few hours. This would eliminate a lot of the macroers since they would have to be constantly looking to see if they got stopped by one. Even just one every two hours would make a huge difference in the amount of people doing this. These type of captures are probably the best ones they could do because if they fail they don't get banned or wiped, instead it just kicks them to the main hub until they complete it. And I know this would prevent a lot of false bans or wipes, because a lot of people in my community post said that they were watching a show on another monitor while farming and didn't even notice when they got checked. It's easy to see how that could happen quite a lot, since people have multiple monitors like me, and when you're watching something else while farming, you don't really pay attention to the screen. And if you're a new player to Skyblock and have no idea how they do macro checks, and decide not to really pay attention and watch a show on another monitor, you would risk getting your entire profile wiped because of it, which doesn't make a lot of sense. At least with the capture you'd be able to understand that you need to pay attention and not be wiped because of it. On top of that, they seem to have barely any staff to do any of the bedrock checks anyway, which is probably why I didn't get macro checked at all. So if they actually just automate this where they can check everyone without wiping and banning people, I think this would be the best solution. So let me know in the comments, do you have any better solutions to macroing? And thank you to all of our patrons for continuing to support our websites, discord bots, and videos. Check out all the perks you can get in the link in the description. Thanks for watching.